to Red Dead Redemption 2. Uh, I promised I was going to stream this, so we're here now. Um, I'm hoping the sound works. I know in Fallout it didn't work for quite some time until I got into like this radiation field and then suddenly the sound started to like calm down and relax. Um, <coughs> and that, hope everything's working. Let's find out real quick because I don't want to be a fool. Hello? Well, that's not bad. That sounds pretty good. Cool. Rockstar Games for I'm sorry, I couldn't read Garza for a second. <laughs> I was like, you know, like, it's just, I don't know why. But, you know, because we haven't been taught cursive much, and some can read it, and I am understanding it more. But if I have the time to actually look at it, I'm pretty sure I could figure it out. Did not mean to blow on my mic like that, but you know. Abigail says he's dying, Dutch. We'll have to stop someplace. Okay, Arthur's out looking. I sent him up ahead. Uh. If we don't stop soon, we'll all be dying. It's weather, it's May. Just hoping the law got as lost as we did. There! Arthur! Any luck? I found a place where we can get some shelter. Let Davy rest while he... You know... An old man in town. Abandoned. It ain't far. Come on! Come on! Yeah! Chapter one. Colter. We read that long way now. It's whatever. Bring him in here. Gaskell, get that fire lit, quick. Miss Jones, bring in whatever blankets we have. Mr. Pearson, see what we've got in terms of food. Davy's dead. There was nothing more you could have done. What are we gonna do? We need supplies. Well, first of all, you're gonna stay here, and you were gonna get yourself warm. Now, I sent John and Mike scouting out ahead. Arthur and I, we're gonna ride out, see if we can find one of them. And this, just for a short bit. And I don't see what other choice we have. Listen, listen to me, all of you, for a moment. Now we've had, well, a bad couple of days. I loved Davy, Jenny. Sean, Mac, they may be okay. We don't know. But we lost some folks. 
Now, if I could throw myself in the ground, in their stead, I'd do it. Mm -hmm. Sure. But we are going to ride out, and we are going to find some food. Everybody, we're safe now. There ain't nobody following us through a storm like this one. And by the time they get here, well, we're going to be, we're going to be long gone. We've been through worse than this before. Mr. Pearson, Miss Grimshaw, I need you to turn this place into a camp. We may be here for a few days. Now, all of you, all of you, get yourselves warm. Stay strong. Stay with me. We ain't done yet. Come on, Arthur. Amen. All right. We've got some work to do. We ain't run into them yet. So they both must have headed down the hill. Sure. Hey, I ain't had time to ask. You. What really went down back there on that boat? We miss you. That's what happened. Come on. Oh. Hey, you need horses? Oh, yeah. Hey, Mr. Smith, get yourself indoors. You need to rest that hand. I'll live. Get indoors, son. Bye. Yeah, man, it's really cold out. We need you strong. Okay. The beauty of this game, even though it's like a little bit old, right? The beauty of it is so nice. We have to try. Stay close. We'll do our best to run. Just run. Keep up. Can you keep up? I have to follow you, but like, can you keep up? Oh, it has to blow over soon. Bridge coming up. Take it easy. Go too slow, my friend. Just look at this. Can't believe we lost Davy too. Oh, shit. He's the last one, Arthur. No more. I mean, I've we been thinking of streaming this for a while. I did play it before. Um, At least we don't need I didn't finish it completely. Like the story-wise, I haven't finished the story completely. I'm on like the whole other section of it. Right now. Hey, I think but, I see something know. up the path. Oh. You up ahead. Who's there? <coughs> Micah. Gentlemen. Found anything? I think so. Found a little homestead down that way. Okay. Anyone home? Sure. Place is blazing with light and noise. Sounded like a party. Let's go see. Follow me. <clears throat> Let's go doing? see. Follow me. <laughs> Nor did little Jenny. That's too bad. Davy was a real fighter. Both of them calendar boys is. Or <laughs> was. Yeah. And Mac, Sean, we don't know. Quite a business. I'm glad you're all right, Micah. Always. Ask him if he's seen John. Hey, have you seen John, Micah? Didn't see much of anything once this storm came in. He hasn't seen him. He'll be fine. Things always turn out right for that boy. <laughs> yeah. Mac and John. Sure. Mr. Morgan, I never thought I would be so pleased to see your face. Been kind of lonely out here. Where's everyone else? Old mining camp back up the hill. Huddled around a fire waiting for daddy to put food on the table. Said it before, we got too many mouths to feed. 
Well, we got a few less now, so you should be happy. That ain't... Okay, let's keep it down now, gentlemen. It's just up ahead. Snuff and stash those lanterns, boys. Best you two lie low on this. Okay. Oh, I see him. Let's head down there. Can we kill some people? No. I'm so holding it in this picket. All right. Yeah, I see my health. It's blinking and it's getting annoying. <laughs> Make it stop. Let's hitch up here. They didn't see our lantern come down. Like, what kind of fucking idiots are these? Okay, whatever. We're gonna judge. We're gonna stop the person in another way. Let yeah. me do the talking. We don't wanna scare talking. these. Why are we folks? as we crouch? <laughs> Let me do the talking. We don't wanna scare these folks. Don't mind me being a fucking creep. Someone's having fun in there. You too. Get yourself out of sight. One lonely man is a lot less intimidating than three nasty looking degenerates. Micah. Hide behind that wagon. Arthur, See. you take that old shed on the left and stay low, both of them. Do we have any guns yet? I can't tell. It won't let me pick up my inventory. <laughs> Hello? 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 Excuse me. Of course, his name is Billy. Hello. Kind of oh, well, hello, <laughs> Back in my day, I was named Billy. I am very sorry to disturb you. Uh, my friends and I, well, we got into some trouble up the way, lost in the storm. Ah, uh, gentlemen. <laughs> we can't help you, Mister. <laughs> I got folks, Arthur. Dying on the trail. Arthur, we got a problem. <laughs> There's a body right here. No, I, I just Arthur. need some. There's a body food in the wagon. I hear you. Just Gentlemen. keep your eyes on. Oh, I did not mean to do that. That's my bad. Uh, I won't let me jump. Okay. Oop, headshot. Oh, blast your head. Fire, fire, Eric, I am doing terrible. That's okay. There's a guy behind me. You know what? We're going up. Hello! <laughs> You're still alive, right? Yeah, well, not anymore, bro. You kind of need to die. Are you hurting me? Oh, oh, shit. Oh. Oh, I'm kind of hurt. What do you do? I can't see the bottom because there's a the stream thing. It, it was my bad, to be honest. I did not mean to like peek up. I was trying to look at my inventory real quick because that's what I thought it wanted me to do, but it didn't. Ooh, knife! Stop him. Well, I want to loot the bodies first because oh shit! Sorry, I did not mean to do that. How do we? Uh, I am so I am so sorry. Hold on, I forgot how to play this game. Uh, maybe get rid of the knife. I am 
so, so sorry. I am so not in remembrance of this game at all. Let's just leave him alone. We'll stay in this nice little cabin with David. Look at that lantern. Beautiful. Nearby items. Yeah. Oh, we just like look around. I forgot about this part. I don't believe it. It's a strange one, all right. Maybe they're hiding up here too. There's a big price on Colmo Driscoll's head. Oops. This is all I can say. Is because you know, I wanted to loot the body. Instead, I think I made his life a little worse. He's got a few extra holes, but you know that's all right. Because the man was a douchebag, anyways, right? Hi. Place is dry and warm. We can maybe move the women and Jack down here. Maybe. We'll see how they are when we get back. I don't really want us to split up. You should move them here, because this is a nice place. I'm going to start packing the horses. You keep looking. Look at it, it's so cozy, you got a nice little thing up here, bro. No, don't go up the ladder, who goes up the ladder? Not us. Okay, I forgot how to play a game. Down. 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 Arthur, keep looking for stuff. Arthur, go see if there's anything in that barn. My barn. You search the cabin. See what we missed. This barn. Sure. My barn. Oh, that's the barn, dude. That's a shitty barn. Oh, but it is a barn. I just, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm smart. I swear. <laughs> this game once, I should have expected that. You, you could try. Was it X block? Oh, did he now? Sneaky little bastard. Should I kill him? No. Not yet. I what they're doing here. And where Colm is. Oh, this son of a bitch would talk. Where's Como Driscoll? We have the others. At an old mining camp southwest of here. Near the lake. Near the lake? What are you bastards doing? Why are you up here? Uh, we're fixing to rob some train. Gonna blow the tracks. I don't know more than that, I swear. <laughs> well, I would say it looks like you have this, Arthur. Do what you want with him. I don't care. But bring that horse when you're done. Oh. I don't know anything else. <laughs> Please. Mm. Please. Spare me. I, I promise you, you won't see me again, partner. Please, partner. Every time, Just let me go so home. this game does have a cause and effect system. So we choke him, it affects. Uh, we spare him, we'll probably get like a target on our back. But I do like a man to tell a tale, because dead men tell no tales. However, fucking get knocked out. So. 
That way he's not- you're, you're still alive, right? I don't want to kill you, bro. So that's not what I do. Where's my gun? Oh, God! Wait, why? Pick up the gun. You're still alive, right? Sir? Sir? I'll pick up my hat, and then can I take a look at the guy? He's still alive, right? Oh, my Oh, it says approach the horse. I can barely read that because of the, the stream thing. It says 20 minutes, and 20 minutes is. You're fine. It's all good. Trust me. Cool. Give me a second. Uh, stay right there. Serious? Okay, well, we're gonna hope that he's knocked out. Because that way he can tell a tale another day. Make sure you walk over the corpse, make sure you get some footprints on them. That's not how that works, but you know. Is that bastard still in there? He's dead well. Good. Good. That looks like a decent horse. You should keep him. Tie him up over there, Arthur. Over where? Over here? Snap, crackle, and pop. Give me a second. Can't stay here. You come with you us. Clearly you can't, unless you really want to burn. So it's okay. We're bad men. We ain't then. It's okay. So honest. We're bad men, but we're not them. Trust me, we're worse. Figure out what you want to do. What's your name, Miss? Miss. Adler. 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 Mrs. I, he. He was my husband. Oh, that was the body in the. F you know, I'm starting to realize stuff now. As I go along. Me, man. It's Dutch. Hey, everybody, Dutch is back. How'd you get on? Uh, Micah found a home, yeah, no but he weren't the first. Colm O'Driscoll and his scum, they beat us to it. Uh, uh, we found some of them there. But there is more about, apparently. Scouting the train. Thank you. And that's the last thing we need right now, Dutch. Well, it is what it is. But we found. Some supplies, some blankets, a little bit of food. It Miss is what it soul, is. Mrs. Adler, Miss Tilly, Miss Karen, would you warm her Can't up? Get her Give her so. a drink of something. And Mrs. Adler, it's gonna be okay. 
You're safe now. They turned her into a widow. Animals. I need some rest. I haven't slept in three days. You're over here. Miss O'Shea will show you the way. Mr. Morgan, we put you in a room over here. Thank you, Miss Grimshaw. Mr. Bell, you're with the fellas over there. What? Well, how come Arthur gets a room and I get a bunk bed next to Bill Williamson and a bunch of darkies? Get yourself to bed. Do you want to overwrite your data in this slot? Can I... I can save it in another slot, right? Are you sure? No, 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 I don't want auto save to be turned off. Oh, fuck it. He ain't been seen in days. Weather ain't let up. He's strong. And he's smart. Strong, at least. Hello, Arthur. Abigail. Arthur, how you doing? Just fine, Abigail. And you? I need you to... I I'm sorry. I'm sorry to ask, but... It's little John. He's got himself caught into a scrape again. He ain't been seen in two... Two days. Your John will be fine. I mean, he may be as dumb as rocks and as dull as rusted iron, but that ain't changing <laughs> because he got caught in some snowstorm. Please go take a look. Have you? Yes. Have you? Will you ride out with Arthur <clears throat> to take a look for John? <clears throat> You're the two best fit men we've got. Now? She's. We're all. Yeah, we're pretty worried about him. I know. The situation were reversed. He looked for me. Thank you. This way. Last I know, John was headed up the river. For all we know, he kept riding north and never looked back. He wouldn't leave. Not like that. Uh, wouldn't be the first time. Wait. <clears throat> so pretty. Come on, let's take a look. Let's hope ain't more of O'Driscoll's boys. Well, seems somebody left recently, and that way. Sure. Well, come on then. There's some tracks leading to the river. Yeah. There ain't no way someone survived in this cold with that. <laughs> Raining bullets. Look at the map. No, those are the glaciers. Yep. Watch out for this crevice. Dutch killed a girl in a bad way, but it was a bad situation. That ain't like him, though. 
to continue along the cliff wall here. I really wish they did more with these and had like a mystery to go inside them. Mac and John, both shot for a way to get into them. Sean, we don't even know. But you can't get into them unless if you had like a modder glitch. Bad business, all right. Damn snow's coming in hot again. We'll lose these tracks if we don't move fast. Well, I lost the tracks. Where are they now? Am I blind? I'm probably blind. Over here, I don't see them. Come on, boy. Horses are getting tired. Yeah, a lot of fresh snow here. I don't know about this, Javier. I mean, we can't follow nothing. Uh, let's push on a little bit. Maybe we'll pick up the trail again. Ain't nothing to break my stride. Forgot this whole part to be honest. I don't think we can go much further on the horses. We'll have to walk from here. I'd grab that shotgun from your horse. Who knows what's up ahead? Mother f that gun, Yeah, are you happy now? Let me so ooh. Man says, get that shotgun. Well, I got the shotgun, Javier. Are you happy? I wanted my pistol, but no. Get the shotgun. It's alright. I love Javier. Javier is so good. Careful here. Are you sure you want to go down here? It's coming from this way. Okay. The <laughs> pro has falcon here. I'm on my way. There's a drop here. Drops, falls, dies. It's slippery. Be careful. Okay. 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 Stay low under okay. Here. Uh, let's crouch. Uh, it's left stick is not. Again, I cannot see. The. I think it's the the thingy my jiggy the okay from here you know watch your step it's real slippery stay close to the wall up here come on oh cool we got stamina now. come on that sounds closer now come on now, to be honest, with this, I might do the side missions as well, because it is important to do that, because it, this is one of those games where it's like, holy crap, with the side missions, it's like Batman Arkham, you know, with the side missions, it's like, it's really important. Now, I'll show you what the side missions are. <laughs> I'm miserable. Dude, that's like every Colorado in me. Alright, you got this. Take a drink of that. What is it? Tequila? Or is it 
Uh, whiskey? Bourbon. That's cool. Let's keep moving then. Come on. John! I don't know why, but like tequila and whiskey is the only alcohol I know for some reason. It's my go to, I guess. No, I'm kidding. I don't even drink. <laughs> I don't. I really don't. That's John! You know I don't, if the only ones I know is literally famous, really famous, and Jack Daniels, because Jack Daniels, I remember Jack Daniels because of the unbreakable bottle, you know? Never thought I'd say this, but good to see you, Arthur Morgan. I don't know what I'm saying anymore. It's late. Actually, it's not that bad. It's ten times. Fine. You don't look so good. I don't feel too good, neither. <laughs> Freezing. Don't die just yet, cowboy. Come on, compadre. Well, we can't go back the way we came. Let's try this way. Ain't you a sorry sight? Can't argue with you there. See? I told Dutch you weren't the right man for this. But I'm sure you did. Uh, you alright? I think so. Come on. Hopefully this will lead us out. Oh boy. Look up there. Perfect. <laughs> Marson's like, huh? <laughs> Distract him while you get to the horse. Go! Draw him off! Alright, John, come on. Let's get you on that horse. Here they come. Aim. I am so sorry. I love wolves, but. Don't you even think about it. Shop as soon as I get to my house. Hurry up. Javier, you gotta go faster, man. Dog bite. Got bit by a dog. Died an hour later. You ain't gonna die. Not yet. Well, you get to say that I survived a wolf. That's pretty cool, isn't it? More coming down the hill. Edge of the bite. Ah! Get out of here. Get out of here. Oh, bro, almost tripped over his own pal. Why didn't you shoot before? Hi, sorry, excuse me. Oh, I think I crushed him. Dude, that's tough. Oh my gosh, I got off. I, I hopped on the man. That's what I did. I was like, how did I do that? <laughs> Bro, I am so sorry. That's so unfortunate. Says, I'm lucky. Try to that out, man. Try to lose a scent. Don't want to leave a trail right back to camp. You know, we're gonna need to come up with a better story for that scar. So, freezing, bleeding, starving. Damn near getting eaten. To... <gasps> Don't you jump on them, yeah. man. You would kill this whole mission. Back. Yeah, come on. Let's push. 
Push hard and get back. See those buildings can we all give ahead, like credit to the That's where we camped. the horses? Get there. Like if you think of it, not only do they go into the cold, they go everywhere. The cold, they go into the cold as water. I speak facts, guys. I speak facts. And they're still with us to this day. We get some help. We need some help here. Help muscular man right there. What? We should be taking the same thing. Nice. Careful, it's your task. It's his leg. Struggle with any. Come on, let's get you warm. Thank you, thank you both. This is a new low, even by your standards. Thank you, Arthur. Thank you. Got any other lost maidens need saving? Not today. If you and Dutch talk about how we're gonna get out of this. I was just discussing with Herr Strauss when the weather breaks. I suppose we'll have to keep heading east. East? Into all that? That civilization? I know. The west is where our problems are worse. Come on, Herr Strauss. Let's get warm. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. <sighs> We have been running for weeks. We found shelter and been resting here in some old abandoned mining town while we wait the thaw. Hardly the spring I had been hoping for. So what now, Dutch? We get strong, we get warm, and we wait. When the storm breaks, we move. But we're safe here. Warm enough. I guess. Come with you boys because I thought you liked action. A couple of days on the lamb, and you lot have all turned yellow. Apart from you, of course. Shut up, Micah. I ain't never seen so hey, many long faces. Mm. I guess, I guess folks miss them. That fell. But when I fall, I don't want no fuss. When you fall, there'll be a party. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> a party. <laughs> Probably. Uh -huh. Funny, huh? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> I don't feel like being laughed at by the likes of you two. Stop it! Now! You fools punching each other when Como Driscoll's needing punching hard. You want to sit around waiting for him to come find us? All of you, we got work to do. Come on. Are you sure about this, Dutch? Yes. Both been through a lot recently. We hardly back on our feet yet. And the last thing we need is to get bushwhacked by Como Driscoll. Let's go. I know you hate him, Dutch. He's here for us. I doubt that. No, nope, you're just doubting me. I would never doubt you, Dutch. You. You always said revenge is a luxury we can't afford. This is the right call, Arthur. Take this. And this is about more than revenge for business long ago. They were talking about trains and detonators here. Comb always had good information. Come on. And you think now is the right time to hit a train? Now you might fancy living on deer piss and rabbit shit. I'm getting too old for that life. Mr. Matthews, Mr. Smith, Mr. Pearson, would you please look after the place? There are O'Driscoll's about. Yeah! Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Southwest, right, Arthur? Yeah. He said follow the main trail southwest. They're camped near some lake. Okay, let's go find these bastards before they find us and rob this score of their planet.
that? Tracks. Horses, quite a few of them. As far as I can tell, the only fools out here are us and them. They must be this way. You good, Dutch? Of course. Listen, I know you don't think much of my ideas recently, but this is the right move. Okay. You know I got your back. I learned a long time ago that you can't call Mo Driscoll. Wait for him. The people you love will die. This feud between you and him needs to be put to rest one way or another. It will be. Some things I can forgive, Shut up, Micah. others I can forget. What he did to Hannibal, I can't do neither. You killed his brother, Dutch. Yes, I did. And I hope the bastards will be reunited soon enough. That's how this will end. Damn right, boss. See that smoke? Let's cut up here and take a look. They said it was near the lake, so we Micah's must be close. a suck up, bro. Gentlemen, this is it. Are we goddamn ready? ready? Ready, Dutch. Good. Now, Mr. Morgan and I, we're gonna head up here a little, see if we can't get a sense of the layout of the camp. Mr. Williamson, Mr. Bell, you two take up a hidden position just outside the camp. Mr. Summers, Mr. Escuela, you two hold position here. Let's go. That's definitely them. Home? I think so. Yeah, that's him. Okay, well, it's not bad. I mean... <laughs> Who's he talking to? He don't seem very happy. No. Oop, you just did the little Maybe spec smack. Seem to be. Should we go get him? No. Cone can wait. Best to get some of them out of there. And much less fun to rob him and his score if he never finds out about it. All right. Let's go pay our old friends a visit. Don't forget to grab that rifle from your horse. You boys be ready to pick them off from up there. <laughs> sure thing. Well, let's put my rifle right here. Good. Come on, let's go. Let's have us go. We'll circle around the far side and go down that way, same as Mike and Bill. Like you said, revenge is a luxury we can't afford. Yeah, just wasn't sure you agreed with me. Arthur, Arthur, have you completely lost faith in me? Our needs right now are supplies, equipment, and a way out of here. Everything else, including comb. And wait. Okay. There's enough of those bastards down there to deal with as it is. Now come on.
steep here. Careful. Maybe I should take the lead on this. They're going to be gunning for you. They ain't got me yet. No, but the way our luck's been running... Hush. Let's just get down there first. Follow me. Let's head for that building in front. Sad. Sad they got here before us, so if we just followed them, so, we would have been What are we doing, Dutch? I can take this if you want. Just make the call. You want to take the lead? Go. So we got everything we need. Yep. Make the call, Arthur. Okay, hold on. In the gang. Okay, fine. You make the move. All right, on me. Good luck. I was gonna shoot him. That's fine. I got it. Tired. And, you know, it's okay because I stay up late anyways. Because sleep is for the week. Do you sleep? I don't. Dun 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 dun. dun, dun. Oh, oh, snap. Oh, in here. Oh, we're dead. Do I just not see it? Oh, over here, doy. <sighs> oh, okay, we're climbing on the rooftop now. <laughs> it's okay, guys, I got this. It's alright, don't worry. Give it 
damn about his men. All he cares about is numbers. If you can shoot a gun and ride a horse and kill without thought, you're in. Oh, shit. Look out! More of the bastards coming! Out of the tree! That shot. Ooh, clean. Oh damn, so close. Okay. What the, why is the horse chasing me? Ooh. I am so sorry for your loss, sir. Down. I shot you in the face, bro! You're dead. time because I want to be rich. Making money for free is what I like to do. See, si, senor. I love looting corpses. Cause I'm not psychopath, but I'm there. That made no sense. Just go with it. Back in my day, you know, it was crazy. We, we killed people, right? And then we loot their corpses, right? And then boom, next thing I know, I'm a millionaire. Shut up, I'm looting, bro. Y'all are not rich. And you know why? Because you're not getting any loot from the guys, right? Like, there's like free loot. I mean, like, free. It's in the name, bro. You go search that wagon there. Mike, search that building. Arthur, you take that building to the left. Hey, have y'all seen my hat? I just realized it's gone. Detonators, explosives, anything you can. Let's go. Fine, Dutch, I won't help you when you lose your hat. Jerk. What am I doing in here? Just exploring. Oh, see, see, now the mission's on the top left. Oh, wait, give me a second. Boom! That's what we need, right? Hey, this looks good. What do you think, Bill? Well, looks fine. Smells good. Smells like dynamite, and that smells good to you. Did we I get still everything? Don't smell like? Does think it, so, does boss? Smell good. Found this on one of them. I wonder if it Thank smells you. like cigarette. This is perfect. Oh, yeah. 
Because if that's the case, then it probably doesn't smell good. Train they was gonna rob. Just saying. A Mr. Leviticus Cornwall. Mount back up. Let's keep moving. All right. Let's get out of here. Proud of you boys. All of you. Oh, Not a man me. down. Good work, fellas. Not bad for some starving down and out. They can pummel us as hard as they like. But we will always get back up and fight. That's who we are. Because nothing's going to break our stride. Nothing's going to slow us down. Down, John. Oh no. We must keep on moving. Back riding with us and I believe I know they will all be back. He knows, guys. He, he, he doesn't just think. He knows. Especially when we rob this train, too. <laughs> yeah, I guess we'll see about that. Jeez, guys, you're actually like we're almost like thieves. You know, he'll come That's after a joke, us. by the way. Oh, of course he will. Just saying. Just like all the the oh, look, he's stupid. No, no, I swear. Of them. Make sure we always know where they are before they know where we are. We allowed ourselves to get a step behind in Blackwater. That won't happen again. What it? Or maybe you're just saying that just to give us hope, huh? Maybe you're a liar. All right, dig in, fellas. Let's make some ground. Yeah, guys, we're landscaping. Leave him to me. All right, we're heading back. Just bring him back alive. Oh, I got this. Give me the yeah. You got it. Oh, Mizzou. We need to talk about your uh credit card debt. It's a free real estate. Can I drag him a little bit? Yeah. Dude. No! I need to keep him alive. That's unfortunate. You're Hi. coming with me. You have oh, a nice God, house, sir. No. Kieran or Kieran? No, that's what they all say. They really do. Come on, Mister, please. You better shut that. your mouth, you little shit, or I will shut it for you. Sure hope so. Trying to test me, is that it? 
because I will break every bone in your body. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. Not one more goddamn word. Am I clear? Okay. Okay. That's two bones right there. Introduce you to the boys. <laughs> we the boys. Don't hurt me, please. No, oh, don't worry. They're real nice. Huh. You found a little shit, did you? Yep. <laughs> I got him. Very good. Welcome to your new home. Hope you're real happy here. You want me to make him talk? Oh, no. Now all we'll get is lies. Uncle, Mr. Williamson, tie this maggot up someplace safe. We get him hungry first. I got a saying, my friend. We shoot fellas as need shooting, save fellas as need saving, and feed them as need feeding. We are going to find out what you need. I can't believe it! An O'Driscoll in my camp! No, I ain't an O'Driscoll, mister! I, I hate that fella! Oh, whatever you say, son. Well done, Arthur. I'm just sorry we missed out on Cole. Oh, there's time enough for that. Now, I gotta figure out if we can hit that train. Okay. to death up here, Mr. Morgan. Are we, though? We're okay. We have a few cans of food and a rabbit. For what? Ten, twelve people? When I was in the Navy... I, I do not wish to hear about what you got up to in the Navy, Mr. Pearson. We were stranded at sea for 50 days. And you unfortunately survived. Huh. When we ran away from Blackwater, I wasn't able to get supplies in. Well, when government agents are hunting you down, sometimes shopping trips need to be cut short. We'll survive. We always have. And if needs be, we can eat you. You're the fattest. I sent Lenny and Bill hunting, and they found nothing. Well, Lenny's more into book learning than hunting. Bill's a fool. Unless those mountains are full of game that want to read, ain't no wonder they found enough, enough of this. We'll go find something. Come on, Arthur. Wait a second. Hold on. Uh, here. You're gonna need something to eat out there. Assorted salt and offal. Starving would be preferable. Come on, let's go. You can't go hunting. Look at your hand. I can't stay here listening to you two. Look, if this game in those hills, I'll find it. And you can kill it. You need to rest, Charles. You think this is rest? Come along. Come alone. Here, you take this. I can't use it, and you'll have to. Oh, you're joking. Use a gun, and we'll scare off every animal for miles around. You're never too old to learn, I imagine. Come on, this way. Wait for me, Charles. How are you holding up, Charles? I'm okay, apart from this hand. Stupid mistake. Still bad? It'll 
we'll be fine in a day or two. I just can't pull a bow right now. Uh, All right, I got you. <laughs> Never really got the hang of it. You'll be fine. <sighs> so, you reckon we're gonna find something to kill that it ain't no Driscoll? Huh. There's meat up here for sure. Pearson doesn't know what he's talking about. Now the weather's eased off a bit, they'll be needing to feed. We'll head up this way. Find some higher ground. Whew. Been a wild few days, all right. That ride north from Blackwater, getting stuck in the storm, going out for John, that thing with the old Driscolls. You've had a lot put on you. I wish I could have done more. I didn't mean it like that, just a lot to think back on. I still don't really know what happened on that boat. Me neither. Well, Javier told me a bit, but it sure weren't good. Some of the ground uncovered here. Come on, let's try this way. Keep your eyes peeled for movement. <sighs> the wind's died uh. down too. That's good. No wind at all is bad, but if it's too strong, they won't move. Now shh, stay quiet. Stop here a second. I see something. <sighs> There's deer been here and recently. How can you tell? How can you not? Let's walk it from here. You're gonna need the bow. Don't leave it on your horse. A gun will scare everything around. Quiet as you can. Stay low and move slowly. You see the tracks? I think so. Maybe not. Focus. It's easier in the snow, but once you get your eye in, you'll be able to track the mule as well in grass and woods. Get that bow out, Arthur. Aim for their head or neck. We want a good, clean kill. You can pull back quite hard. You'll feel when it's too much. Quick, before they move.
my stamina go. get up a little bit. Well done. I think that's all we can carry. Oh, that would have been dope. You sure your hands okay? It'll be fine once I get it on my shoulder. Okay, I'll go grab the other one. Hells, yes. That I was like super freaking tired. I'm proud. <laughs> On my way, man. It's not like I'm the Flash. Jeez. Come on, Charles. Oh. <laughs> I miss my hat, Charles. I miss my hat. Not just any hat, that was the hat. So we're gonna go in here. And it's not in here, but. Well, that's okay. I miss my hat. <laughs> Should be enough meat here to keep us all fed for a few days. You found it. I knew you'd be okay with that bow. It's easier when they ain't shooting back. <laughs> We've seen enough of that. Considering how things were looking a couple of days back, well, maybe our luck's finally on the turn. Seems to me we should be putting our effort into getting off this mountain Ooh, now. I see a shot. It's not bad. It's not bad either. Um, advance. Let's go exposure. Let's bring that down. Um, that's pretty neat. That's pretty neat too. That's just nice. Whoa. Whoa, that's cool. 
I mean, not for this part, but like that's just cool. That's the filter. I think I want this one's not bad. So then that could be a thing. This one's not bad either. So screenshot that. And then we're going to go over to the pretty one. Oh, this one's nice. Brings out the color a little bit more. Soon. People are still weak and well, you've seen how snowed in those wagons are. I love photo mode. I cannot tell you how important photo mode is. I am pausing it because I need to check on the stream and make sure everything is working. But I love photo mode. Photo mode is so nice in games. And if you see my Instagram, you'll see that I love photo mode. Because it's just, you know, you can show the beauty of the game. Be like, damn, that's a nice shot. One of these days, I'll just take shots of Red Dead again. Ooh, you went quiet. Why did I go quiet? What the fuck? Hello? Okay, that's weird. Okay, I have no clue. You're weird. Why does my sound weird? <coughs> Do we get some more thaw? Mm, you're probably right. And even if we do get off here, what then? Still have a big price on our heads. This is a big country. I don't we'll know. Maybe it's because I'm getting quieter as I talk. Dutch and Jose will have a plan. Yeah. You notice how Pearson's had a bottle in his hand ever since we fled Blackwater? We give the camp cook five minutes to grab the essentials and go, and he doesn't even bring a crumb of food. Good that we caught more than one. We've only been up here a few days and have already picked up two more mouths to feed. One more. We ain't feeding the old Driscoll a damn thing. Except maybe that can of salt and awful Pearson was kind enough to give us. The girl, she has a wild look in her eye. <sighs> of course. She lost her husband, her home, everything she had. So what do we do with her? Well, once we get out of here and we're back on our feet, we'll see. She might have family somewhere. Who knows? Maybe she'll deal with the O'Driscoll for us. <laughs> well, I know who my money's on in that fight. <laughs> He's weak, but that makes him much more useful. Maybe we can get to them before they get to us. What is it with the O'Driscolls? You ain't dealt with them? I suppose. Hell, we ain't run into them much the last six months. I guess because they've been over this way. Yeah. Uh, I've heard a lot of talk about them. Well, we've been scrapping over scores with them for years. Big gang. Nasty sons of bitches. Their leader, Comb, and Dutch go way back. And not in a good way. A proper blood feud. So I heard. Watch out. Bear up ahead. I see Let's it. see if we can find another way around. Actually. Must be real hungry. Stay well back. Spring storms like this are the worst for animals that sleep all winter. Can I shoot it?
isn't the bear go up here? I don't see his tracks, so I think we're fine. We ain't ever talked that much, you and me. How long you been with us now? Five, six months? Something like that. But you didn't expect this. What? Any of this. Blackwater mess. Being up here? Ah. Sooner or later, a job's gonna go wrong. Nature of life. I just thought you might have moved on by now. You want me to move on? No. No, not at all. I just... I know you could run it alone. <coughs> no problem. I did that for a long time. I'm done with it. Always wondering if someone's gonna kill you in your sleep. I still wonder that most nights. <laughs> I reckon you're okay. This suits me. Sure, I could fall in with another gang, but Dutch... You know... Dutch is different. Oh, yes. Dutch is certainly different. He treats me fair. Most of you do. And for a fellow with a black father and an Indian mother, that ain't normally the case. Well, we need you now. Yeah, Charles. More than ever. You're with us. Good. And how long have you been with these boys? Why ain't you run off? Me? Oh, 20 years, something like that. Since I was a boy. 20 years? Yeah. <laughs> Call me to read. John, too. Call me a few other things, him and Hosea. Huh. I'm sure. Dutch saved me. Saved most of us. That's why we need to stick by him through this. He always sees us right. How's that new horse? He's all right. He'll do for now. I appreciate you letting me take Taima the other night. She's a strong one. It's been as hard on the horses as on the rest of us. I don't know what Dutch would do if something happened to the Count. Same with Bill and Brown Jack. He's a drunk, miserable bastard, but he loves that horse. <laughs> I hope they all make it. I tried to ride the Count once. Fuck me faster than a bull. Won't take nobody but him. I'm gonna hitch time over here. Brought some food back, boys! <coughs> What a surprise to find a camp rat loitering around in the kitchen. Is that any way to greet an old friend? I feel like we haven't spoken for days. I do my utmost to avoid you. Ah, he loves me, really. It's his sad way of showing affection. No, it isn't. Now shoot, get lost. Uh, well, see you gents later. See, you got on just fine. Charles is a wonder. Have a drink, boys. You earned it. Jesus, what is that? Navy rum, sir. It's the only thing. The only thing. <laughs> the Keeps only you thing. saying it does. Yeah, oh. Seems to have done a treat on you. You go rest that hand, Charles. He said it seems things. to do a treat on you. That's skin, funny. Mr. Morgan, it's easier if we do it together. Go get to skin you. <coughs> You're always one with the jokes, aren't you? Come on. This really isn't a job for a man with a burnt hand. I'll see you both later. You skin that one if you dumped on the floor there. Huh. Not 
too bad, Mr. Morgan. Yeah. They always said you were a butcher. You know, you could trade these or sell these in pretty much any town. If you're looking to make a legitimate bit of money, of course. Right now, I'm just looking to get off this mountain alive. Well, if you catch anything else, you bring it to me. Sure. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Heck, Arthur Morgan's first decent bit of hunting after all these years. Yeah. Well, we're on the run now. Everyone's got to do their bit to survive. Just make a good stew. Folk need it. It's been a tough few days. Yeah. <coughs> it's been a bad few weeks, but Dutch being Dutch, he is busy making plans, and Dutch being Dutch, those plans involve robbery and dreams. Well, I thought you was reading him his last rites. Now I see you're introducing him to your other passion. I'll mind you to show me some respects, Mr. Morgan. Mind away, Reverend. You still here, then? I owe you. Yeah. Yeah, you'll pay me. But for the moment, just rest. Arthur. I think it's time for the train. You want me to come? Of course I do, but... Look at you. I was always ugly, Dutch. It's just a scratch. Don't lie still, son. Hello, Abigail. Dutch? Jackie. The boy wanted to see you, John. He's seen me now. Or what's left of me. What about you? Guess I was hoping to see a corpse. <laughs> Bide your time. You'll see plenty of them. You're a rotten man, John Marston. He is an idiot, Abigail. We all know it. Now, railway men. Bill, now you ride ahead and set the charge at the water tower just before the tunnel. Ain't a problem. Why are we doing this? Weather's breaking. We could leave. I, I thought we was lying low. Yeah, come on. What do you want from me, Hosea? I just don't want any more folks to die, Dutch. We're living, Hosea. We're living. Look at me. We're living. Even you. But we need money. Everything we have is in Blackwater. You fancy heading back there? No. Listen, Dutch, I ain't trying to undermine you. I just... I just want to stick to the plan, which was to lie low, then head back out west. Now, suddenly we're about to rob a train. What choice have we got? Leviticus Cornwall's no joke, Dutch. Well, who is Leviticus Cornwall? You know, he's a big railway magnet, sugar dealer, oil man. Well, how good for him. Sounds like he has more than enough to share. Dutch. Gentlemen, it is time to make something of ourselves. Get your horses ready. We have a train to rob. All right, we're moving out. Follow me. PM. Listen up, all of you. According to the information so kindly provided to us by the Odrissians, the train will be coming north from Big Valley. We're going to pick it off after it crosses the border into the Grizzlies. There's a raised spot there that should give us good vantage. Charles, you'll keep lookout for any outriders. How's that hand, by the way? I'll be fine. Good. I'll take the driver and engineer, then run point. Lenny and Javier, you two take the front cars, deal with any guards. Arthur and Micah, you head straight for the back. That's what we're after, Mr. Cornwall's private car. You and me, Morgan. Hey, have you got a problem with that? Not if you keep your head for once. You worry about yourself, huh? Enough! After Bill blows the tracks, we're gonna need to move fast. Is everyone clear on what they're doing? Yep, Crystal. Yes, boss. Good. Now come on. Let's ride.
See how he's getting on? Okay. those rocks over there okay sure now just unspool the wire and then attach it to said detonator to the others. I've got it from here. Soon find out. Everything okay? I think so. Okay, cover your faces. Train should be here any minute now. you, Arthur. All right, Ben. My bad. Gentlemen, it's time. Good luck, all of you. You all know what to do.
kidding me? Where did you find that moron? You said it was fine. So it's my fault. Come on! You're pathetic. You know that? Uh. Oh boy, we go. We go. Oh. You're right. I got you, I got you. Hey, down here! I've got, got you, Lenny. Now stop yelling! Huh? Oh, shit, shit, shit! Yeah, you're okay. Come on, buddy, I got you. Now, let's go slow this thing down. Where's Javier? He fell! The others will get him. You got so lucky on this. That's a face oh, shot, dude. What do you mean? Some fellas holed up in this last car. Ah, shit. What are you boys planning on doing in there? Listen to me. We don't want to kill any of you. Any more of you. <laughs> <laughs> I give you my word, but trust me, we will. I work for Leviticus Corps. Come on, boys. We got our orders. Okay. You asked for it. We are opening this door. Four. Three, two, one. Seems our friends have gone deaf. Wake them up a little. Wake them up. Mr. Williamson, give Mr. Morgan and Mr. Smith some dynamite. You two boys go blow that door open.
Now, it don't matter too much to us, but you boys in there might want to take a step back. Seems good enough. Now light the fuse. Here we go. Unless you got a death wish, I'd step back, fellas. Hello. Search that train. <laughs> I am at the private car. I, I, I'm, I'm here. Go loot the train. Yeah, it won't Wait. let me, senor. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> nothing is working. Nothing is working. Why is nothing on, working? Dutch, shut up. They won't let me go. There we go. Finally. Look at this God. place. <laughs> it's like a palace. Now I've seen everything. Oh, you two got the safe? I'll search the rest. Oh, yes. Should be easy as cake. <sighs> You're just gonna stand there, kid. Pour me some brandy, will ya? I'm parched. Shut up. Me and Arthur did all the work. Yeah, kid did good. Didn't see you rushing to jump on that train. He's king. I'll give you that. Okay, let's see if we can get this open. Come on. Come on. Get in there. That's how it's done. Shit! Just a pile of papers. Bonds? I don't think so. Here, make yourself useful. At least we all know you can read. <laughs> Give me those. Railroad contracts, invoices, blah, blah, blah. You got anything? Not really. Sugar imports from the Spanish West Indies. I think I got them. Nice. Well, thank God. Come on. <clears throat> what did you find? These bonds. They worth anything? Oh, sure. Fair bonds. I think we can probably sell these pretty easily. Well done. Now, would you get rid of all of this? The train? Yeah, get it out of here. What about them? Well, what do you think? I don't know. <laughs> it's up to you. Kill them, leave them here, take them with you on the train. Just make sure they don't send no folk after us. Okay. See you back at camp. When you get back, we'll be moving on. The rest of you, let's ride. <laughs> Okay, get on the train, quick, all of you. Any bright ideas, I kill all three of you. So behave. Come on, move. We won't tell a soul, I swear. Go on. If I hear so much as a footstep from this car, you'll end up like all your friends out here. How the hell are you gonna hear a footstep all the way at the end of here? I'm just saying, man. Like, you're, you're pretty far. I don't think you're gonna hear a freaking footstep. How am I taking them? I've never done that.
took away and go hell. So we getting out of this hellhole? We're gonna try. Weather seems stable. And we just robbed the Leviticus Cornwall train. We got money in our pockets. The worst is behind us, gentlemen. So the question uh, is, where now? I know this country a little. I told you, we should set up camp in Horseshoe Overlook near Valentine. We'll be able to hide out there no problem, as long as we keep our noses clean. <laughs> well then, let's go. Clean noses and everything else. Arthur, you're in that one. Bring Hosea. I know you two like to talk about the good old days and what's gone wrong with old Dutch. Very beautiful. Lenny! Micah! Get over here! Yes, boss. You two ride up ahead, make sure there's no surprises. We've had enough of those. Me? With the boy? Just go. Come on, kid. You can buy me a whiskey. Oh my bad, I am not looking. Gotta keep us moving, but calm. Not too rough there, brother. Ah, shit. Okay, let's take a look. You all right back there? Does everything look all right? Whoa, well, what's going on? Ah, I broke the goddamn wheel. All right, let's get it fixed. You need help? I reckon we can handle it. All right, Charles, you and me hold the thing up while you try and put the wheel back on, Arthur. You still strong enough to hold up a wing? Shut up. I'm just saying. Well, say less. Pick the wheel up. <laughs> Nearly there. there. See? You ain't so useless after all. <laughs> Not quite. trouble, we wouldn't have seen them. Poor bastards. We really screwed them over down here. Come on, let's not push our luck. What happened? Well, get in. I'll tell you. Not too far now. Stay on this trail. Follow the river, then cut left inland. So, yes, the Indians in these parts have sold a very odd deal. This is the heartlands we're going to. Good farming and grazing country, they lost it all. Stolen clean away from them, it was every blade of grass. Killed or Herded up to the reservations in the middle of nowhere. And how's that different from anywhere else? 
Well, maybe it's not. I just heard some of the army out here was particularly uh, unpleasant about it. Unpleasant? Man, people are still up. That's crazy. How do you rob and kill people pleasantly? We don't. In spite of that, just talk. I fear I was perhaps trying to simplify something more complicated for the benefit of our blockheaded driver here. Hey, don't blame it on me. Never forget, this here's a con man, Charles, born and bred. Just because it sounds fancy don't mean he knows a damn thing about what he's talking about. Yeah. So... Breaks the wheel again. What happened to your tribe? I don't even know if I have one. At least, not that I can remember. My father was a colored man. He told me he lived with our people for a while. A number of free men did. But when we were forced to move from our lands, the three of us fled. I was too young to really remember much. My whole life I've been on the run. A couple years later, some soldiers captured my mother. Took her somewhere. We never saw her again. We drifted around. He was a very sad man, and the drink had a mean hold on him. Around 13, I just took off on my own. That was about the age we found young Arthur here. Maybe a little older. A wilder delinquent you never did see. But he learned fast. Not as fast as Marston, apparently. Wait, I don't understand. What's the problem between you two? Arthur? Yeah, it's a long story. Yep. Are we still heading the right way? That depends. Are we still heading west in search of fortune and repose in virgin forests as we plan? No. Are we heading in the correct direction on our desperate escape from the law eastwards down the mountains? Yes, I believe so. You know this area? A little. I've been through a couple of times. There's a livestock town not too far from here called Valentine. Cowboys, outlaws. Where are we? It's not bad. No, don't. Working girls, our kind of place. The Driscolls? Probably them too. Pinkertons? Let's hope not. And this place we're going. Wait, what's it called again? Horseshoe Overlook. It's a good place to lie low. It'll do for now. Now how low do you think Dutch is really going to lie? <laughs> it's just, you know, maybe it's me who's changed, not him. But we kept telling him that fairy job didn't feel right. You and me had a real lead in Blackwater that could have worked out. Maybe. It just isn't like Dutch to lose his head like that. Things go wrong sometimes. People die. It's the way it is. Always has been. Me, you, Dutch. We've all been in this line of work a long time. And we're still here, so... Well, I figure we must have got it right a hell of a lot more than we got it wrong. What are you working on there, anyway? Just some yarrow and ginseng. Good for the health. Better than that stuff you buy in the store. Yeah, you can have all this. I'm at the point where I can do it with my eyes closed. Oh, okay, thank you. Yeah. Going. There you are, brother. Head in there. Follow the track for a bit. <coughs> hey, slow up. I'll jump on.
Okay, let's go. Any trouble getting in here, Javier? Nope. It went well. This is a good spot. Excellent. I think this will work for us, Arthur. For now, anyway. Here we are, gentlemen. Home sweet home. You learned long, Jose. This place is perfect. Are. I hope so. Gentlemen, we have survived. For now, now it is time to prosper. Arthur and I were about to prosper in Blackwater. We were onto something big. Then Micah got you all excited about that ferry, and here we are. We have all made mistakes over the years, Jose. Every last one of us. But I kept us together, kept us alive, kept the nooses off our neck. I guess I'm just worried. I ain't got that long, Dutch. I, I want folks safe before I go. Me too. And now we are stuck east of the Grizzlies and out of money and a, a long way from our dream of virgin land in the West. I know, my brother, but we are safe. We make a bit of money here, then we move again, head out around them, be west of Uncle Sam, in a few months, buy some land. I hope so. <laughs> Would you just look around you? This world has its consolations. <laughs> Gentlemen, I'm going to head into the local town and, uh, you know, see if I can strike up a little business. Of course, mm -hmm. Herr Strauss. I prefer robbing banks to usury. Seems more dignified somehow. Now, everyone, put your tools down for a moment. Come on, gather around. Quickly now. I know that things have been tough. But we are safe now, and we are far too poor. So it is time for everyone to get to work. Get to work, but stay out of trouble. Remember, we are itinerant workers. Laid off when they shut down our factory to the north. Now get out there and see what you can find. Uncle, Reverend Swanson, no more passengers. <laughs> <laughs> it is time for everyone to earn their keep. There is a town a little way down the track named of Valentine. Livestock town, all mud and morons, if I remember right. That seems a decent place to start. And, uh, we need food. Real food. That means every day. One of you. And remember, whatever it is that you find, the camp gets its slice. Now be sensible out there. Now the girls have your tent ready, Mr. Morgan. Come with me. You two will be ready shortly. We put you over here. I'm sure everything will be fine, Miss Grimshaw. It should be. Most of your stuff from Blackwater got saved. Everything apart from my money. Oh, don't remind me. Well, we can always make more money. We're gonna have to. Miss Jackson, I've seen shit with more common sense than you. Do it properly. <laughs> Chapter two. Couple weeks later. Pretty. Got off the mountain, rode east into some pretty enough country called the Heartlands. Been this far east in many a year. Dutch seems a little better. His eyes are sparkling once more, and I can see he's thinking a little clearer. I think we all feel a little happier, in spite of black water and that whole mess. Arthur, who's it there? Quite a day. Let's hope so. There's a bunch of the boys already in Valentine. Bill, Charles, and Javier. 
And Swanson found something down at the train station by the lake, apparently. And Strauss <laughs> came back with that creepy little smile on his face. I'm sure there's a whole list of unfortunates he's forced money upon. <laughs> Thank you. And you? I'm gonna read the book. <laughs> Course. Well, I'm going to leave this here for now, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. I think it's pretty decent.